What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to another episode of On Again with Andre Glenn. Today, I'm going to be doing an embroidery test stitch using the PE800. So, I have a new digitized file and we are going to test the stitch. All right, so welcome back. All right, so for this, I'll be using my, of course, I'll be using the USB stick connected to the PE800. As you can see, I have a USB stick that connects um into the mac device as well as a regular usb it has a usb c as well as a regular usb connection so that i'm able to easily uh remove and extract files from my macbook okay so for this test stitch what i'll be using is my four by four hoop here um i'll use my four by four hoop i'll also be using my adhesive spray I'll be using just some uh, scrap cloth material. Uh, this came from 100% cotton gilding t-shirt. All right, so I'll be using that. I'll also be using my applique scissors, uh, my smaller applique scissors, and then I'll be using my fabric cutting scissors. I'll be using cutaway stabilizer. All right, so uh, let's get this started. So I'm gonna take just one sheet of my cutaway stabilizer. All right. All right. Moving that over to the side. So I'm gonna take my cutaway stabilizer and just Spray a little, spray a little adhesive on the back of the cutaway stabilizer. This is not necessary, but I'm doing this. All right, really don't need it in this situation, but it's good practice for me. Set that across. Take my hoop. Loosen my hoop a little bit. Nice and tight. All right, so now we got everything squared away. Um, just for demonstration purposes, I'm gonna go a little further and just kind of cut some of this excess t-shirt off. So you guys can see the print. All right, so I did that so you guys can see the print as it's being done. All right, so we got everything done. Now I'm gonna take these two scissors and I'm gonna set these next to the uh, embroidery machine. And we are going to move over to the embroidery machine. All right, so here we are. I have my USB stick, my memory device in there. So I am going to pull the file up so I can figure out which colors I need, all right? So I'm gonna simply touch the home screen, touch the screen. It's gonna say that the carriage of the embroidery unit will move. So keep your hands, etc., away from the carriage. I hit okay. As you see, it makes its moves, its motions. Uh, it says, would you like to go back to the uh, previous memory? I'm gonna hit cancel on that because I wanna start fresh. Uh, all right, so I'm going to select my files here. Uh, let me get to my files. All right, so here's the file I'm looking for. 
I'm going to test this file here and I'm going to be using a four by four hoop. I'm going to hit set. So it's pulling my file up. It's going to let me know which way it's going to come out. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and put my, lift my wheel up, my footer here, stepper, whatever you call it. I'm going to slide my hoop in to the grooves here. All right, my hoop is set. All right, so yeah, sure, why not? I want it to face this way. That's fine with me. Uh, if I wanted to rotate it, I would simply select rotate, 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 depending on which side the actual garment or object is that I want this image to be facing, but this is fine. That's the way I want it. So I'm going to now and edit, all right, and I'm going to go to embroidery. So those should be the core colors that I'll be using throughout this. All right, so the first thing I need to do is load my machine. Pulling this out, this is already cut. Load our green here. Send it through. One, two, three. Bring it down to six. Wait a minute. Put this footer down. Put the footer down, then bring it down to six. And there we go. So thread. And we are ready to start. So. All right. In order to get started, I just go ahead and. Start. So it kind of cut itself out. So this point, oh, I'm just gonna lift that on up, pull this one out, load up my next color, which will be this fuchsia. Put it back down. Put the footer back down. Thread. All right, already time for the next color. All right, this up, this out. Send it through real quick, real quick. Send it around six, wrap it. That footer down. Send it through, it's through. I'm going to get a little quick snap. Quick little snap. I don't need all that. Press it through. All right, now I'm getting ready to go ahead and uh, switch the memory card on this camera while this runs. Be right back. If you can't tell the difference, all of the colors have numbers. And like I said, there's a chart that goes along with this. I didn't say it now, I said it.
Well, y'all, as we draw down to the final stitches, this is it. We'll go ahead and get these, uh, get these jump steps, get these jump stitches out the way. Got one little mess up right here. I'm gonna go ahead and clean that up before I send that to the customer. And let him see. Finished embroidery is gonna come across on the screen. I'm gonna hit OK. And I'm gonna go ahead and pull this out of here. Lift this footer up. You know, I really don't have a problem with this. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Until next time. Peace.